Hello there, welcome to an update video about what's going on with my Hackintosh. Um, I thought I'd just throw it into ScreenFlow just to give you a rough idea and show you exactly uh, basically what's been happening. Now, as you guys know, I've got a brand new 8-core um, um, processor, AMD processor in this system. Um, I've got 32, gigas of, 32 gigabytes of RAM. Um, it's, you know, SSDs, um, it's, it's a blazing fast machine. Now, I have got a 40 graphics card at the moment, um, which is stopping me from doing intense things like rendering or video editing and stuff like that. Now, the GTX card, I know is the problem because even when I'm in Windows and I'm trying to play a game, I get a lot of graphics tear. And, you know, you know I've just basically imported a video to um, <coughs> Final Cut, and as you can see, um, it's got a lot of tear up you know on the screen it's, it's you know it's just not working properly this graphics card um, so basically um, I've ordered a new graphics card we're putting a, uh, a GTX uh, Titan Z in this in this machine I'm just waiting to get that delivered and we should be uh, good 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 to go uh, for this Hackintosh and we'll well be able to um, do whatever we want now as you can probably notice I've got Mavericks running on there purely to the fact that um, Mavericks is the only um, uh, operating system um, or OS X that will not give me a tear up on the actual desktop itself when I installed Yosemite and Yosemite by the way is just as easy to install on this system um, as uh, Mavericks is um, because Yosemite has got a lot more you know higher graphics interface shall I say it's a it's a, it's a it's a more sort of crisper operating system um, I'm getting lag on the actual screen um, as well I'm getting lag on on the actual desktop and it's stuttering and that's not due to the fact that there's something wrong with the system it's due to the fact there's something wrong with the actual GTX card uh, the 460 card um, so yeah it's a bit jarring but I've sort of you know wanted to sort of persist with this experiment you know to get um, uh, make a uh, Hackintosh my sort of daily driver and I'm sort of there um, sort of temporarily but like you see I can't do sort of nothing um, intense um, with this I mean it won't even let me open up um, uh, Nuke Studio because of the graphics interface um, on it I can open up some programs um, if I just open up Smoke for instance you might see some tear up here and I can show you exactly what I mean uh, by this uh, when I open up smoke I get and it takes a lot longer to load as well and you remember there's an SSD in this system so there's a serious problem with a with a with a GPU serious problem um, which is going to be resolved as soon as I get my new GTX card can you see the tear up there yeah there's a lot of uh, glitching and so on and so on so even when I start as you can see look at the tear up look at the glitches on there and that's nothing to do with the Hackintosh in general it's purely to do with the fact that the card um, is failing basically um, on the actual uh, in the actual system so uh, we've ordered I'm just gonna quit out of here because I don't want to stress it out too much um, because I'm gonna I'm not gonna have another card until the other one turns up so I'm gonna have to sort of um, bide my time I can surf the net um, on it no problems um, everything's working fine uh, audio uh, is working fine everything runs great except for doing anything that's really intense then the graphic card starts to struggle um, hence why I've uh, got Mavericks on here at the moment but you know it's weird because when you look at it it looks I mean look at that that's just fast as anything you know, I have got 32 gigs of RAM. I've got the latest AMD 8-core processor. I think it's a 9530 processor in there. So, super fast processor, uh, super fast RAM, uh, super fast uh, storage like the SSDs and stuff like that. Like I say, guys, the only problem I have with this uh, GTX card in there, which has stopped me from installing Mavericks. Now, obviously, I was thinking to myself, you know, can I actually install Mavericks on this system? Um... And it, because it was tearing up, I thought it was actually, you know, the the installation I was doing something wrong. I was putting the wrong text in, wrong drivers. Until I thought to myself, bollocks to it. So I put basically Windows on, 
uh, updated Windows uh, uh, as far as I can go, put all the DirectX on there. And then when I went to play a game on it, I was getting the same sort of tear up, which tells me that the problem I'm having is with the actual graphics card itself. Now, I am getting, I'll try and show you if it'll let me, getting all these pop ups as well, which is not good. But, oh well. I am getting this one GTX uh, Titan uh, Z. So, this is the, the new Titan Z that I'm going for, uh, which is here. Um, and this is really going to push this Hackintosh. Um, it's going to make it fly, basically. It's going to be an awesome little card. Um, 12 gigabytes of uh, GDDR5 memory. It's got ridiculous. I mean, look, 5,760 CUDA cores. It's an absolute fucking monster of a card. Um, and at nearly three grand, I should bloody think so and all. But it's going to keep me future-proof, and it's going to keep this system running absolutely fantastic. So for now, I'm going to, well, for a week or so, I'm just going to have to make do with, you know, not being able to do certain jobs. I mean, I can, for instance, I can open up, um, I don't know, let's say, for instance, real flow. Yeah. I can open up some programs that will let me open up. Um, and it, it open up fine. Um, but it's when I start throwing real intense stuff at this card um, that I start bloody getting problems. So let me just show you what I mean, see if it does it. Um, let's go to a, uh, let's have a look, let's have a look, right, let's go to a demo scene, it'll probably make me look stupid now, and probably load up fine, um, let's go backwards, let's try and play that, it will just bloody you see that how slow that's running with the with the processor I've got on here um, in here and the RAM I've got on here in here um, that should just literally be smooth as anything because this is you know just I think when I bench tested this system even with the 40 card I was getting a score of about 19 and a half thousand on Geekbench and that's even with a dodgy you know failing graphics card so um, it is a bit you know disheartening you know for instance when I try and use handbrake um, I'm going to reload something right watch this I try and encode this video see just cuts out and that's basically the the card uh, the card's fading basically that's why I'm getting these errors so it's just a quick update guys Hackintosh is running I am running Mavericks but the GTX Titan is on its way to Titan Z which is going to be an awesome card combined with the other um, uh, stuff that I've got inside this uh, Hackintosh it is going to be a, a monster of a Hackintosh really is um, like I say I've got an 8 core modern processor in there so it's like you know let me see if I can just show you the processor I hate Google because I did something on Google and now I keep getting these pop-ups and I don't have to get rid of them but Let's go uh, AMD 8 core. Uh, 9, I think it's this one, 9590. There we go. Um, so, let's go to images. Um, so, we've got the 9590. Why did I think it was a 9530? Anyway, um, this is basically what we've got the 9590 8 core uh, processor in this beast. So a very, very, very powerful processor. Um, you know, it's got some amazing scores. Um, I don't know if this will show here. Uh, it clocks up to fa basically five gigahertz. It's just below, you know, it's just below the 470, 470K. Uh, um, but what a, what a really beast of a, of a CPU. So, um, yeah, guys, like I say, just a quick update to let you guys know what's going on. Um, as soon as I get the new card, uh, we're right into this uh, system. And um, basically, we'll see how we go. Um, we should fly, really. And then we'll put Yosemite on there. Um, and then we should be good to go. So, as always, guys, thanks for listening. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Ciao, ciao.